Intercontinental Hotels Group is the world's most global hotel company, controlling 3,500 properties around the world. Its well-known portfolio of brands includes Holiday Inn, Crown Plaza, and Candlewood Suites. IHG depends on its technology infrastructure to manage everything from reservations to facilities. And it depends on Xerox Global Services to keep its IT systems running smoothly. Right after 9-11, you know, our industry took a tremendous hit. Planes not flying, guests not staying in hotels. So obviously the trickle-down effect had a tremendous impact on our business. We had a charge by our chairman across the board. Every department had to really drive cost out of the business. The goal uh, that was uh, set was $100 million for the whole company. That significant savings target translated into a real challenge for IHG and Xerox. The two main objectives were how can we reduce the cost by a specific number, in this particular case $1.2 million, and how can we improve um, the customer's um, satisfaction as it relates to the services we provide. The Xerox team recognized that this complex project lent itself well to the disciplined approach of Lean Six Sigma. Applying Lean Six Sigma to the IG situation was appropriate because of three key reasons. Number one, neither us nor the customer knew how to achieve this 33% reduction in IT span and at the same time improve customer satisfaction. So we turned to Lean Six Sigma, which is a discovery-based approach. Number two, most traditional methodologies focus on two of the three key productivity metrics, quality, cost, and delivery. The wonderful thing about Lean Six Sigma is it focuses on all three. And finally, we knew we had to maintain a shared vision with our customer throughout this process. So we used the Lean Six Sigma toll-gate review process to ensure that. Um, the Lean Six Sigma study, uh, initially when it was proposed, there was some skepticism uh, within the building uh, because uh, we have done this for 30 years and nobody thought that it could be improved or could be done better. After we proposed Lean Six Sigma to IHG, um, we left the meeting and really wanted to dig into the $1.2 million. We realized and recognized that the $1.2 million represented over 30% of the cost. We identified that most of their expense was for death side services. And the second most was around server support, and last was around help desk. So we prioritized our projects in that order. The measure phase of the Lean Six Sigma process allowed the Xerox team to quantify key metrics and make some compelling connections. When we analyzed the customer satisfaction data, we found we were measured on five key areas. We had overall customer satisfaction, knowledge of our staff, professionalism, technical ability, and fixed time. And what we found was when overall customer satisfaction was low, meaning a score of one, two, or three, also, fixed time was very low, a one, two, or three. So there was a tight correlation between fixed time and overall customer satisfaction. So it really took an intangible metric, customer satisfaction, and made it tangible. The Xerox team established the current state by gaining a clear understanding of key variables, such as the cost associated with each type of ticket, the total number of tickets, and average fixed time. Specifically, they found that it costs five times more to fix a problem using desk-side services than by using the help desk. IHG generated 12,955 desk-side tickets per year. And finally, fixed time averaged a surprisingly long 13 hours, data which proved to be a critical piece of the puzzle. Careful analysis of the data revealed a number of hidden opportunities for improvement. Reducing average fixed times to six hours or less would significantly improve customer satisfaction. Solving problems at the help desk instead of at the desk side, which accounted for 45% of the volume, would reduce the cost of a ticket by 80%. Updating the IT environment from Windows 95 and standardizing from four systems to a single operating system would reduce ticket volume by 10%. Avoiding duplication of effort between Xerox and another service provider would reduce costs. With a clear roadmap outlined, the team was able to implement process changes that over the next 12 months will result in savings equal to IHG's ambitious goals. The total savings, 
$1.2 million. Xerox's ability to drive customer value through the fact-based approach of Lean Six Sigma took the relationship to a new level. Lean Six Sigma changed the relationship because it really demonstrated to me that Xerox really understood my business and they became a stakeholder. So instead of being a vendor, I think you can really say that we became more of a partner in this particular endeavor.